hello and welcome to tutorial for you channel in this video i will show you how to fix this error windows cannot assess the specified device path or file you may not have the appropriate permissions to assess the item so let's fix this error together clearing catchy file can help resolve various issues with epic games launcher and fortnite open your file explorer in the address bar at the top type percentage local app data percentage and press enter this will take you to the local app data folder select epic games folder epic game launcher folder and fortnite game folder right click and select delete make sure to close the epic game launcher or any fortnite related processes or you will get an error also don't forget to empty your recycle bin to permanently delete the folders after deleting this folder Restart your computer and ensure that the changes take place. Adjusting compatibility settings for specific files in Fortnite can be a helpful solution to address performance issue. Launch the Epic Games Launcher on your computer. Navigate to the library section in the left sidebar of the Epic Games Launcher. Locate and select the Fortnite game in your library. Click on the three dots near the launch button for Fortnite. From the drop down menu, select Manage. In the Manage window, find and click on Open Install Location under Installation option. This will open the installation folder for Fortnite. In the Fortnite installation folder, open Fortnite game folder and then open Binaries folder and then Win64 folder. Locate these four specific files. Right click on each file, select Properties from the context menu. In the properties window, navigate to the compatibility tab. Look for the section that allows you to choose a compatibility mode. Choose Windows 8 from the drop down menu in the compatibility tab. Also in the compatibility windows, uncheck this box which says run this program as an administrator. Click apply to save changes and then click ok to close the properties windows. Do this for all four files. Right click on each of the four specific files, select properties from the context menu. In the properties window, go to the security tab. Under group or user names, find and select the entry corresponding to your user account. If unsure, perform this for all users. Click edit and ensure your user account is selected in the permissions window. Check the box next to full control under the allow column. This will grant full permission to the selected user. Repeat this method for all the user and all four files. Give this method a try and if it works for you, let me know in the comments. If it doesn't, I have a detailed video on this topic and its link will be in the description. So please check that out. I hope this video helped you and if it did, please give this video a like and if you want to support the channel, hit the subscribe button. That's it for this video. I will see you in the next video. Until then, take care. Have a nice day.